everybody, I'm Canon Explorer of Light, Lindsay Adler. I'm a portrait and fashion photographer based in New York City, and I am super excited for today's headshot challenge. Hey guys, my name is Peter Hurley. I am a Canon Explorer of Light, and I specialize in headshot photography. I'm based out of New York City. Now, I've already picked out the gear that I want to use. I'm going to be using the Canon R5 and the RF 24-105. Now, I'm one of those lucky people that got my hands on this camera before it was even released, so I'll actually be shooting with the pre-production model. Now, the reason I've chosen the 24-105 is because it's versatile, and I'm going to be moving around a lot. I hope to capture quite a range of images. So if I want something a little wider, if I want something a little closer, I've got that range. And today I get to shoot the brand spanking new EOS R5. How cool is this? This bad boy, oh my gosh, I've been loving it ever since I got my hands on it. My lens of choice for today is the RF 85 1.2 DS lens, which I love for the shallow depth of field and the proximity to my subject. All right, so we all know that Peter is the master of headshots, and he really is. So I'm not going to try to beat him with a standard headshot. Like that is his domain but I am the master of lighting. And so that's where I'm going to really shine and that's what I'm going to focus on. So, you know what, if people hire me to do a headshot, they're not hiring me to do Peter's style, they're hiring me to do me. And that means I usually do something bold, a little bit dramatic, something creative, and so that is my plan of attack for today's headshot challenge. So, what I think I'm going to do is first knock out that standard, really uh, essential headshot, then immediately move on to something a little bit more dramatic, and then I'm going to add a dash of color. So it's going to be like boom, 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 one after the other, and it gives my client some variety, but also it lets me do something different from Peter. So what he's going to do, he's going to, this is my opinion, he's probably going to focus on his squint, he's going to focus on expression, but I am going to focus on light and doing something different. All right, guys, so this is the plan. I'm excited. This is gonna happen. We're gonna get this down. Now, I gotta go against Lindsay. I knew it was Lindsay. I know I'm going against Lindsay. She's an Explorer Light, super talented, ridiculous with her lighting and, and how clean everything is, or retouching spot on. So I have a challenge ahead of me. So how am I gonna go about this? I'm gonna go, well, you know what? My thing is like, keep the lighting really simple. Do my simple beauty lighting for headshots. Get a natural beauty in here. Keep the makeup to a minimum and work the smile. I'm all about expression. If I can get a beautiful smile out of Ellen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a shot at this. So that's my strategy, that's what I'm going for, and that's the way I think I'm gonna get it to go down. Now, I only have two minutes, so I don't, there's not that many poses or too many moves, so I have to be funny and I gotta get energy in two minutes. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go for that big energy, two minutes, fire it up, see what we can get. So these let's keep a little happier and kind of some good posture. Perfect, little smiles, that's great. Jam your forehead out. Nose a little bit this way, hold that. Keep the hint of the smile and I'll take a shot straight right there. Hold that, that's it. Now just don't move, just give me a couple variations of the smile. Now do one that's a little softer smile. Good, that's perfect. And lower your left shoulder just a bit. Great, and pull up and stick your chin out. Stand up straighter, lean back a little bit, cross your arms in front of you. Hold that, keep the hint of the smile. Great, and then give me a little smile. And give me a giggle. I need, that's it, that's it, that's it. I love the teeth, I'll take the teeth. You give me teeth, I'll take teeth. You... Love that, great, okay. You wanna give me some teeth, I'll take the teeth. What do I got to lose, we got nothing to lose. There you go, stay there. Jam your forehead out, keep your chin up. Off to the side. Let's switch the background light. Good, that's so cute, I love that. Keep the hint, make sure the energy's in the smile. Don't overdo, don't, that's it. Can you kick a brow? I'm creating something called checkerboard lighting. A Little bit of drama and contrast here, so chin. That's it, keep your chin up like that, I love that. Nose back to me a touch. Chin this way a little more, good. Give me a little furrowed brow. Beautiful, that's it, keep the smile. Hold that, that's it, 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 that's it. I'm gonna add a gel into the shadows over here. And then let's actually pop a gel on that background light. I feel like this could be kind of cool. Something like teal and blue. Good, real serious, perfect, and 
Great. How much time do I have? That was it. <laughs> <laughs>everybody so much for watching it was a ton of fun but now here's the challenge it's the challenge is to figure out what wins the uh, Hurley approach or the creative funky approach be sure to tune in to see who the winner is